Hi, good evening. Um, let me get my finger out of the way. It's a little hard. All I have is just my phone to do video recording with. So, so um, it's... So I do apologize. I may, uh, I'm going to be answering three questions that were posed to me about Asian men, black women, pers uh, relationships. Uh, otherwise known as, a known as AMBW. The first question is what got me interested in AMBW and black women? Well, I've um, spent the majority of my life since daycare uh, around black people. Um, in particular, when I was younger, it was the uh, my f my friend Donda. There was the Dunbar family, and they were also part Panamanian. Um, <coughs> I live in Norfolk, Virginia now, so the population does have quite a few uh, black people in there, and uh, I began thinking about what what the chances of me um, having a relationship with a black girl were and um, that actually came true in March of 2009 unfortunately she's moved on to um, it's a long story but she's down in Georgia and oh, there's my there's my bird he's a little He's a parakeet. He's an English budgie. <laughs> I guess he wants to be video recorded too. Now, we still talk. And we're still... Um, we're still together. It's a long story how she got down there. You know, she was up here for most of the time. And... Um, Uh, we we talked about marriage and and um, and things like that. Down here, we don't have really any AMBW couples down here, but we do have some interracial couples, and and I found a few. It looked very um, interesting to me. If I look tired, I'm, I did work today. Um, the, of the other thing is that I happen to be racially mixed myself because my mother is from Japan. Um, that's where she was born and raised. And uh, her, her parents are a native of that country. The, so... <sighs> So to me, and 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 um, uh, we we look forward to possible potential for marriage one day, and uh, and one of these days we're gonna get a video or pictures or something together. Um, that would be really really nice. Uh, the next thing I. Have I had any positive experiences with black women? <clears throat> I've I've had uh, obviously having the long term friendship with Donda. I've had I've had some good um, <clears throat> experiences there. You know, and we used to we used to hang out a lot together. We went to we worked together. We went to school together. Um, <clears throat> now. As, as for my boo, <laughs> I learned how to use that word a while back, um, probably about six or seven years ago. And uh, some people thought that it was kind of funny. Anyways, um, I can't, I don't. We, we've had 
some we've had some difficult times, but we've also had some really really good times. Uh, we you know I we've gone on some dates. I've also met her kids, so definitely that was a good experience because they love me. And um, I um, look forward to being their stepdad. Now, I do believe that we're going to have some more good, some more good experiences and, and other experiences that we probably should have had by now, but we haven't. Um, back in August, uh, uh, my friend Michael drove me down to Georgia. Um, it was it was the longest drive that he's he's ever taken. He's really never driven out of the state of Virginia before. And we went all the way down to Columbus and I got to see her. <laughs> um she uh she fell asleep while she was waiting. <laughs> oh then when then when had to come time to leave. I didn't want to leave. Not because, and it, and it was because I had to leave, leave her again. Um. That was that was difficult, and um, you know, and and I can kind of sort of imagine, you know, some some married couples have some you know issues because one of them might be a truck driver or a long distance bus driver or maybe a pilot or something, and they're gone for a long time, and um, and of course it's put some strains on the relationship, but. Uh, You know, we've, we've, both of us in our lives have gotten through a lot of stuff, so we can get through this, too. And I think it's going to be worth it. <laughs> so we can resume having some good experiences again. And would I date? Now, if something did happen, um, would I date another black woman? Yes, I would. Um... I don't, I'm an open opportunity friend, I'm an equal opportunity person, um, but when it comes to my relationships, I, I am kind of picky, especially after the past ones that I've had, or past friendships even, that I've had, um, that didn't turn out so good. <laughs> this um could this could I I think that this is going to turn out to be something good though. And uh and I have the goal of finishing school and graduating school again. Uh, let's see if hopefully I can actually do it this time. And, um, <clears throat> you know, partly because of her, I've taken up, um, I've taken up some, some things I've, um, I've set I've set a few more goals in my life. I'm even helping. I'm even a part time business partner for another friend of mine. <laughs> yes, that's going to be the most exciting part of the video is the bird. <laughs> um, 
which helps him, it helps myself, it helps her, it helps hopefully a couple more of my, of my friends. Um, it's a lawn care business, and he's also into this Market America, which I'm going to be joining. Um, it's, it's also good to have more than one income. Also, um, between her kids and my nephews, I, um, I, I get inspired and I get encouraged to keep going and um, I'm going to probably prove that it's it's never too late to make something of yourself <laughs> and when I first just after I met her I became I got elected to the board of directors for the Hampton Roads Public Transportation Alliance and that was pretty cool so, I know I can do it, and, um, and hopefully we will be together forever, because I'd like to have her on my, ow, <laughs> I'd li like to have her on my journey, <laughs> that, that hurt, um, very fond of her and her kids so okay if you bite my eyelid one more time <laughs> uh, but I don't have the heart to shoo him away um, do look forward to more questions and uh, hopefully I will have some more answers until that, until then, peace out, and, uh, you know, remember that we're all humans, okay, and, uh, we all need love, doesn't matter what our religion, religion is, what our beliefs are, um, what our skin color is, we are all humans, and, um, God loves all of us.